rare or fish, regarded as omens of natural disasters, found alive in Japan. Fishermen were stunned to discover two deep sea fish believed to be ancient harbingers of earthquakes and tsunamis alive in nets in the Japanese island of Okinawa. The two oar fish, about 3.6 meters, 12 feet, and 4 meters, 13 feet, long, were found off the island's southwest Toya port on January 28. One of the oar fish tore in half after being loaded onto a ship and was partially eaten by one of the fishermen. The other died after arriving on land. The two oar fish were swimming vigorously in the nets, said Sadami Higa of the Yamans Fisheries Cooperative Association. They look mysterious and beautiful. A number of dead oar fish have washed up in Japan and Peru this year, sparking fear that another earthquake or tsunami may be on the horizon. Traditionally known as Ryugu no Tsukai in Japanese, or the messenger from the sea god's palace, legend has it that they beach themselves on shores ahead of underwater earthquakes. The myth gained some traction after the 2011 Fukushima earthquake and subsequent tsunami, which killed more than 20,000 people. At least a dozen overfish had washed up onto Japan's coastline in the year prior to the disaster. But scientists dispute such claims. Uozu aquarium keeper Kazusa Spa told last month that global warming or subtle changes in the Earth's crust could cause the current to stir and push creatures at the bottom to the surface, 